You just spent hundreds, maybe even a thousand dollars on a brand new high refresh rate gaming monitor. You plug it in and you're ready for that buttery smooth 240 hertz experience the pros have. But what if I told you that right now it's probably running at the exact same 60 hertz speed as your old office monitor? It's one of the most common and painful mistakes in PC gaming. Today, as your savvy tech advisor, I'm going to show you why your expensive monitor might be a waste of money and the three simple settings you need to check to unlock its true performance. The number one reason this happens is that Windows by default often sets new monitors to a basic 60 Hz refresh rate. Even if the monitor is capable of much more, you have to change it manually. It's easy. Right click on your desktop, go to display settings, scroll down to advanced display and find the drop down menu for choose a refresh rate. If it says 60 Hz, you are not getting what you paid for. Crank that up to the highest number available. Second, you need to check your GPU's control panel. Sometimes your NVIDIA or AMD software can override the Windows setting. So, open your GPU's control panel. For NVIDIA, that's the NVIDIA control panel. And go to the Change Resolution tab. Make sure the refresh rate listed there also matches your monitor's maximum speed. And finally, the third setting to check is inside the game itself. Many modern games have their own video settings, and sometimes they can default to a lower refresh rate to save resources. Always go into your game's graphics or video settings and make sure the refresh rate option is set to the highest number your monitor supports. That's it. Check Windows, check your GPU panel, and check the in-game settings. It's a two-minute process that unlocks the single most important feature of your expensive gaming monitor. Don't waste your money by leaving all that performance on the table.